Hey guys, welcome back to Daily Duel. So today is Tuesday, means we are using Satella Star Sephir Seraph deck of yay awesomeness. <laughs> and we're also tagging with Tiago. So I got a little bit of news to tell you guys. As you guys know, uh, lately there's been a lot of uploads of uh, Dragon Ball Z League on my channel. A lot, lot, lot. And I just wanted to inform you that there will be no more uploads on my channel. They actually requested that I upload to uh, the original test channel. And so from now on, I'll be doing the uploads there. The videos that are currently on the channel are going to stay there because they're in the playlist. So all I did was just put t make a new playlist on the channel and you just put take the videos off my channel and redirect from my channel over to their playlist. So you don't have to worry about that. But I just wanted to inform you that, uh, yeah, there will not be any more... Um, Dragon Ball Z League on my on my channel anymore, so I apologize about that. Okay, well, I got some plays, but uh, I might have to use your monster because I really don't want to do the plays that I, I want to do right now. So yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and use your monster. So go ahead and flip up that electromagnetic turtle, and I'll just go ahead and summon you, and you'll summon my uh, my uh, my star. Set off, and then I can make my my nigga, my nigga, my nigga, uh, Delta. So yeah. So uh, if I inconvenienced anybody with the the spamming of the Dragon Ball Z League videos, I apologize. But yep, we're just going back to regular old fashion. I mean, if you still want to see them, I can go ahead and redirect you to you know where you can still see the videos. And if you want to join the league, oh, definitely join the league. And if you want to join Team Boo, then. <laughs> Alright, you're not allowed to join the league unless you join Team Boo. Just to tell you, we really need some help. Like, really bad. Okay, clearly he wants to stop me from destroying his monster. So, is it really worth attacking into it? That's the question. That's the question. Should I attack into it? That is the question. Because clearly he wants me to... Right. But if it's a flip effect, then he can just flip it next turn. Or should I, yeah, you know, or should I just pass it to his partner? His partner may not be able to utilize it. So clearly, if he wants to protect it, let him protect it. You know. And what should be like Raikou or something? You know, if it's Raikou or something, if I get pumped. You know, I think I still get my effect unless I, get, I miss timing. Uh, this card is you can special. I think I would miss timing. Oh, there's. Supply squad or supply unit. I actually talk about that card in the card uh, review. So if you haven't watched that already, you can go ahead and watch that. <laughs> Shameless plugs for myself. <laughs> uh, I'm terrible. So yeah, that's some news. So I, I, I will still be doing Dragon Ball Z League videos. It just won't be on my channel. I also set a restriction on everybody who I upload. I pretty much said. Uh, only three tests per day because I, as you clearly saw, there were too many goddamn videos on the channel, so I decided to limit that shit. So each team only gets three videos per day because I think Sam, uh, one day Sam's got like eight videos, and oh my god, I was exhausted. So definitely just wanted to go ahead and limit the amount of uh, tests that they can pump out. Oh, it was Raikou, and he just didn't want to flip it up. All right, well he gets to draw the one card from Raikou, but he when we kill this monster, it's only once per turn. Yeah, I already talked about that card, so. Crusher's gonna be crushing lives! Oh, there goes Zephyros the Elite. I mean, he can always return the supply unit back to his hand and summon it again if he wants to. But he really wanted to protect out Raikou. Ah, uh, is there anything else that I really want to talk about? Uh, live stream coming up. It's on the 24th, I think. So make plans. You know, set aside time for that, so you can come to live stream and win a mat and join me for some Yu-Gi-Oh fun and also, you know, my uh, tag partners. You know, uh, no, I know there's a lot of controversy about Tiago not joining. The thing, the reason why Tiago couldn't join is because a he doesn't have a mic and. It would be hard to, you know, talk to him and contact him and, you know, tell what's going on when he doesn't have a mic. He kind of has, like, a laptop thing, but he says his house is always noisy, so it's better not to just, you know, so it won't be a whole bunch of noise. Um, also, I try to limit down to four because it, 
unless we if we don't go with four then we have to go up to eight because then it would be a bracket tournament you know and i didn't want anybody to have any buy or anything like that so it had to go up to eight and i don't have eight people who can you know join so i decided to just leave it like that that's really up to you if you want to use your electromagnetic electromagnetic turtle to block then go right ahead he said it's not worth it. All right. He said it is not worth it. I wonder if he has the honest in his hand. That would be good to know if he has the honest in his hand. Because honestly, if he has honest, I'm going to honestly... Well, actually, actually, I could just make a another one, can I? No, I can't. I can't. Well, I could. I can go summon you, chain you, summon you... And then make another one. I could. Yeah, you know what, I'll go ahead and do it. Sirius is such a good card, but it's not good till later in the game. Because right now, it is just poop. Also, this is still the April lane list, so still no second Rota for me. Tear. I should be okay, though. I should be okay. Alright, I'm gonna get rid of both the cards. Unless he has another effect veiler. Watch him have another effect veiler, but like, why do you run so much effect veiler? No. And if I try to pop right now and he blocks me with effect veiler, then he clearly has honest. Yeah, he has honest. Another effect veiler, though. Go ahead. It's not like your freaking Aaron can't kill me anyway, but I know you have the honest, but double effect veiler in, in hand, okay. I guess. Keep negging yourself. I don't mind. I do not mind. We got the Book of Moon right here already, so as soon as soon as you summon a level four, I'm gonna book that shit. But double effect veiler. No people make that effect veiler like that. You really think about it to neg one, but I guess I guess you play it so you don't neg one off of the pop, but I guess. I know I'm the one that keeps on getting fucking effect veilered, but So is he just thinking or what? I still gotta record Vitamin Y, but if if freaking D end updated, oh my god. I'm probably not going to be able to get on there and duel because everybody and their mother is going to be on there, you know, trying to get their rating back up and shit. Oh my god. So, uh, and, and I probably won't be able to, it will probably be full. I mean, I'll try, but I don't know. It's not looking very promising. Getting on DN and, and recording by the way is looking just as promising as this guy doing something with his turn. Ha 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 ha. Ah, that was funny. So what's he gonna do? He's gonna use Zephyr as the elite, return the Aaron back to the hand, take the 400, summon the Zephyr, then summon the Aaron. No, that's fine. You're just gonna make fucking uh, Abnadis anyway, or or maybe uh, Catastar if you have them. So we're going up against Yang Zing. All right. Sure. Don't know what the fuck that is, but whatever. Uh, you can only use that effect in the is This kind of code is since they're your opponent's card effect or being shot by battle. You can target a monster and get your except this bitch, and so she'll summon it. No, that's fine. Nice D. Token 26. Woo, look at that ass. No, it's fine. I've been putting that work this entire duel. Fucking. Tiago hasn't done shit! <laughs> no. So at least it can't summon itself. That'd be annoying. Just kill it, summon it back, kill it, summon it back, kill it, summon it back, kill it, summon it back. So that's good. So he can bring back no one important. No one important. <laughs> Like, Tiago, I'd be carrying you, man. They destroy my frickin' 
Star Sapphire is during Tiago's turn. The struggle will be fucking real. How many white swans are in the grave? Uh, one, two, three. I see three. One, two, three. Okay. Because drop the drop the droppage of JD, the struggle would be real. At least there's no priority, so we can go when he goes summon JD. We can go book a moon. That's good because you know back in the past it'd be summon JD, book a moon, priority. <laughs> so no, no priority. Yes, JD spell speed one. Party was just so fucking OP. Back when it, it, it existed, it pretty much make monsters that were like spell speed, like one and two, like spell speed two and three. Like you can go summon BLS and your opponent can go solemn judgment. You can go priority effect. Like no, 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 no. That's not how this shit works. Damn the struggle. My deltas are almost out of materials. <laughs> Man, I wish it was the Lightsworn guy who was across from me, so when he summoned JD, I'd get all my effects. But no, it's the Lightsworn guy. Surprise, surprise, more Lightsworn sitting across from Tiago. So if he decides <gasps> to drop JD this turn and wipe, I'm I'm out of the game. And it looks like Tiago's probably out of the game as well. So we burned up a shit ton of resources to pull off these plays. So hopefully, if he summons JD, if he can somehow get another Light Sworn in the graveyard. Magical Planter. Interesting. If he can somehow get another Light Sworn to the graveyard through like Solar Recharge or Charger Library or something, then drop JD, and we book him in it, and then he drops another JD? I mean, he already milled out for one. Oh, what's up with everybody use- oh, fucking great. Alright, well, I'm pretty much out of the duel. Fucking great. Of course, Dark Cole. That's pretty- that's, that's just as bad. That's just as fucking bad. Well, we're out of resources. My god damn it! Fuck. Really? Really? Oh, of course, it's a fucking Dark Hole. And not during my turn, either. If it was during my turn, I'd be fine. But no. It's fucking during Tiago's turn, so I get nothing. Fucking nothing. Oh, my God. Why did why did Tiago overextend? That's the question. Why? He was perfectly fine. He, we were perfectly fine. You didn't have to summon that fucking... <sighs> fucking dragon, you really didn't. You should have just saved the goddamn resources, but you didn't. Uh, oh my god. Because summon you and you can be summoned. No, because uh, this card cannot be summoned except for three or more. So nope, can't use them. Can't even go into a two. That's how bad the fucking struggle is. Thank you, fucking Tiago, for overextending for no damn reason. Now we're going to lose. No, no. no, it's not the bad hand. It's that you overextended. We were fine. We were perfectly fine. You didn't need. We didn't need to throw that fucking dragon on top. That extra three thousand wasn't necessary. It really wasn't necessary. Now we're gonna get it. Now we're gonna fucking get it. Ah, oh, I'm sorry. I just don't like losing because of stupidness. That's essentially why we're gonna lose. Because a, my shit didn't get destroyed during my turn, but during Diago's turn, and then b, Diago decided to overextend with that. That was a fucking two-card play for no reasons. Now I can't even do anything. I better hope that I draw a fucking other Star Sapphire. I'm fucked. He was just so he was just so goddamn sure that we had the dual lockdown that he decided to overextend. Wow, he actually sent a level eater. 
He was just so freaking confident that he decided to overextend with that dragon when it wasn't even necessary. So I hope Tiago has something or else we lose. Because you know what would have been awesome right now? This upcoming turn, if he would have dropped Odd Eyes. Not Odd Eyes, Galaxy Eyes. If he would have dropped Galaxy Eyes. That would have been awesome. This upcoming turn. No, oh, we'll take the damage. We'll take the damage. It's not even worth blocking right now. Not even worth blocking right now. But now, he probably has nothing. He has one card in hand, drawing into two. He better be able to do something. Better be able to do something, or I'm gonna be very disappointed. Doesn't it have some restriction on it though. Oh, well that works. Nice top deck. One of those was the top deck. Was he searching for expedition? Uh, expedition. Alright, well, it's time to kick some butt and take some names. Glad you top decked. Very di dangerous situation, but you top decked. Alright, what you gonna make? Oh, grand. Alright. Does the Lightsworn guy mill any more Lightsworn monsters? Yeah, right in Felice. Lumina or uh, Stardust. Yeah, he has four. Yep, he definitely has four, so we're just screaming, please, sir, JD us. I mean, he can't wipe the field because it's held ranking the gate, but he could still drop the 3000 beater and attack us, so. Uh, we're still not in the best of situations right now. Yeah, we probably still lost, because he probably has some kind of Dragon Ruler. So he'll probably just go Dragon Ruler, banish his quest I've been summoned, get back to JD, summon the JDs. Yeah, that's that's still game. That's still gonna be game. Unless I I don't know. I don't know if sure we're gonna actually survive this turn. Cause I know he has some kind of I know he has the dragon rulers. He just wants you to use fucking Felgrand's effect on that shit. I wouldn't have Book of Moon did. I would have Felgrand and Gate saved the Book of Moon because you know he's gonna summon JD. <sighs> Lots of dueling of Light Sworn players. A ton of Light Sworn players lately. Shit ton. Of course he wants it to the top of the deck so Tiago doesn't top deck shit. JD time already. See, and that's why you shouldn't have used the Book of Moon on the fucking Lumina. Summon JD. Attack, 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 attack. Yep. Oh my god. Tiago's fucking misplaying today. We're gonna lose because of it. Forgot about that electromagnetic turtle. That saved our ass. So it's up to me. It's up to me to do something. Hopefully I'll draw into something. Yep, I drew into something. I drew into something. So what can I do? Can't make you. You know be who who'd be fucking awesome right now? Fucking that one bitch that I didn't put in here, the fucking snake thing. 
I wrote to myself, probably put it in. Well, I got a lot of work to do. Got a lot of work to do. Oh, that is true. I can make an exiton. That would be for the best. Can't search you. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Yeah, here he's up, so let's go ahead and make an exiton. I didn't even think of exiton, to tell you the truth. Watch him have the third fucking veiler. If he has the third fucking veiler, I'd be just flabbergasted. We're gonna take the hit to the chin. Not out of the woods yet. I wasn't even thinking about Felgram. I wasn't even thinking about him. I completely forgot that Felgram did that, to tell you the truth. I'm so concerned trying to think about what the fuck we should do out of this situation. We're probably still gonna lose, because we're still down on resources. At least next turn I can go ahead, if I get a next turn, I can summon Altair. I might as well flip it up, why the fuck not? But really, it's kind of useless. It might be best. If freaking Felgrand just wipes the field. Might as well use Felgrand effect again, might as well. Even though I know that fucking face down is a, is a fucking yang thing. That's the fucking pain in the dick. This whole duel is a fucking pain in the dick. It might be better just to do nothing. Cause that yang zing. I know that's a yang zing. That's the thing. Uh, I wasn't even thinking about Felgrand. Okay, I don't know what the fuck happened, but apparently we lost connection. So I guess Tiago quit, or I don't know. I don't know. Well, whatever, I'm going to call it an episode anyway, so. <sighs> Thank you guys for watching. Thank you guys for all the support. See you guys tomorrow with, uh, Mermels. Maybe slaying with Slate, I don't know. I haven't talked to him in a while, so maybe. See you guys tomorrow. Thanks for watching.